But first, we're gonna get into the house because there's a sandstorm coming. Shit. Hurry up. One is just a little one. I think it's just a little one. All right. Yep, we're good. All right, so let's. Uh... Wow, there's not a ton of space in these boxes, is there? <sighs> Seeds in there, I guess. Never mind. Take that. Should probably uh, grab some food for the journey. far we're going to be going here, so. Good. Where is he? Is he under the water? I can't tell where he is. Sounds like he's over there, but I don't see him. Hmm. He must be... see him in the water. I don't see him out of the water. Very confused. Anyway, I'm going to quickly cook this up and then uh, night is falling. I want to see if we can find uh, find that guy. Good, we got more. Excellent. Is the best when I last saved. Um, it kind of auto saves as you go, but um, what I'll do is I'll uh, I'll, I'll just give the uh, reestablish my position at the spawn point there. Okay. Oh shit! I was gonna make uh, clothes. Damn it, I don't have enough. There we go. Well, I don't know. Is it nighttime? Yeah, it is nighttime. I'm going to uh, just quickly grab some more items here and I think as we go I'll just make clothes and stuff okay so where is the statue so we want to head down this way it's fair ways too but uh, we'll get there but I think having the having the pike is gonna help because if we do get into fights it's uh, a little more effective. Also, the fact that I busted, boosted my strength uh, a fair amount as well should definitely help. Okay. Well, uh, yeah, great. Just deal with it.
Don't have enough. Oh, crap. Okay, I need I need light. Come on. Thank you. I mean, it's not a ton of protection, right? But it's something, so. Okay, so now. There we go. And we'll grab a little. Alright, so we're gonna head down this way. Let's see. Yeah, we're gonna head down this way. see a beacon. Yeah, so there's one of the beacons. Right, we need to get past the, uh, the broken bridge over there. Way past. Oh crap, there's guys over there. Hold on, we'll go this way. Yeah, it's just past the broken bridge, if I remember correctly. Like, it's fairly close to it. Nice big landmark. Oh, hey. <laughs> yes. Yes, I did. I think where I want to go is right over this way. Oh, fishies. Yes, that's the beacon there. That's the one I was thinking of. Okay. So there's a guy nearby here. Have to get past the broken bridge. Sort of keep bear in mind where the beacon is. Come on. Get there. Yeah, up here. Oh. Crap, and of course there's an alligator. Um, hold on, I think I can just climb. Yeah. Good. Just get up here. Why are you climbing on the ground? Seriously? There. up higher. Higher, higher, higher. Let me go up here. Yes, this is him. Hold on. Right. Fuck. Oh my god. Just had to be one more. I finally find the damn guy. And now we gotta listen to my 10 minute long requiem.
Oh, see there! It actually stopped there. That's good. Now, before we do anything, I had the foresight to get another one. We're gonna go here. I really hate the hyenas. I have always hated the hyenas. I will never not hate the hyenas. Okay, now, good news is at least we know exactly where we're going. That was the guy, by the way. We found the guy. There it is. If I can get in and raid my body. He's not even that far away. Oh, you know what? I actually was following the right beacon. Because there it is. It's still, you can still see it in the day. It's massive. Oh, shit. I'll go over here. I have nothing. I, I literally just have my loincloth right now. I'm relying on raiding my body to get uh, stuff. Oh, for the advent of fast travel. Can we fast travel? Where am I? Oh, death. Death. Oh, look at that. It actually shows us exactly where we died. That's that's kind of cool. That's different. Shattered Bridge. Is that where I died? Oh, that's where I died before. When I was on my way there. We need to go there. Alright. Cool. Sentinels. Shattered. That's cool. So it puts landmarks there as you... Discover stuff. Neat. Okay. Well, let's keep heading over this way. Gotta get back to where we were. Oh yeah, over there, the, the waterfall. That's where I died before. Yeah, I remember. I remember. Oh, I'm about to just waltz right into... No, go down. What the hell? Why have I got an arrow in my face? Okay. Alright, we're almost there. We just gotta get up there. I just gotta get up to my body. Holy crap, Conan, can you swim any slower? Here we go. Alright, there we go. Good. Now, uh, we are very close. To where I died did. Okay, so we want to go around here. Really? The alligator is up there. Why are you going up there? Okay. Okay. 
Okay. Stop trying to look up my skirt, everybody. What are you doing? Okay. So it was up here. Yes, I found my body. Huzzah. Take all. No. Uh. <laughs> wow. Alas, poor me. Um, I gotta say, at least the death position isn't as ridiculous as it was before. That actually looks kind of brutal now, which is good. That's how it should look. Where the hell is my pike? Uh, use the axe. Oh, I gave my corpse back the pike. That's just silly. Alright. And I guess I don't have the, uh, the hand ones anymore because my hands got chewed off. <laughs> There we go. All right, good. Now, let's go chat with this dude. Shamans rise. How's it going? New, new the cannibal. Stay your hand, stranger. Come, look into the pit. The Lord of Empty Abodes mm. awaits therein. Mm. I am his shaman, Nuno. Your <laughs> coming was revealed to me in the whispering of a bat's wings. Ah. Learn emote. Cheer. Okay. Learn religion. Acolyte of Yog. Talk. My heart has a question. Do you know the Lord of Empty Abodes? He knows you, child, hmm. through the flesh of your kind. Uh -huh. He hungers to know more. All flesh is knowledge, every savory thought. <laughs> Bring us knowledge of others. Yark is generous. Uh -huh. We are exiled without conviction. Our crimes are of no moment. My crime was my belief. What matter the age of the flesh that my lord consumes? Does the lord of empty abodes make a distinction between flesh in the womb and flesh outside of it? Hmm. Now my tribe walks without a shaman, and I seek the pure flesh to feed my god. My lord whispers to me of this place. He walked here in ages past. Uh -huh. Here, there was a banquet of flesh for his pleasure. And kings called upon his wisdom. It is men who destroyed that age of abundance. Yog urges us to seek atonement. Mm. The flesh we bring is an atonement. Association of past sins. Well then, anything else? Yeah,
All right. The dark rage. The blood cage. What all is in there? Is it coals or something? All right. Cool. Um, so there's nothing we can actually do now with that because he needs certain types of flesh. At first I thought like rotten flesh. I had human flesh from like exiles that I'd killed, uh, but nothing. Like I don't, he needs something very specific, which we just aren't able to get at this point in time. Um, okay, we don't have anything here. Journey. Okay, we completed chapter two of the journey. See, I like this. I like this because this gives us actual, you know, definable goals, which is good. Um, so let's see. So chapter three, what do we got to do? We got to uh, equip a piece of light armor, scout a Darfari camp. Oh, that's dangerous. The Darfari are... A lot tougher than the uh, regular exiles. Uh, obtain an iron bar. Sleep in a bed. That's a tall order. I've never slept in a bed in this whole entire game. I've always used bed rolls. Uh, shoot an enemy. Ah, you're going to make me learn archery? Do I have to learn archery? Venerate the gods. And get ahead. Want a trophy of your adventures? It says, I was here. I slaughtered this thing. For example, a head. Some creatures can be harvested for their heads, which can be stuffed and mounted on walls. Yeah. All right. The gods are watching. You realize that whatever your feelings about the gods in this place, you need to avoid offending them. You should find or create an altar and see what the gods have to offer you. Use an altar just like any other crafting machine. If you are a worshiper of that particular god, the recipes available to you will show you show on the right. Shoot an enemy. Bashing heads and lopping off arms is a brutal but necessary part of life. You're starting to suspect, however, that it might be better to try and kill your enemies from a distance. <laughs> Besides, hunting antelope would be so much easier. You decide that you should find a ranged weapon and try it out. Craft or find a bow and arrows. Okay. Yeah, so that's... Sleep in a bed. Or you can just borrow someone else's bed if they'll let you. Beds are much more powerful than bed rolls and do not despawn once they have been used. Craft a bed in order to have a permanent, until someone destroys it, respawn location. Okay, that's cool. Your wooden stone tools are no longer sufficient. Blah, 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 blah. Get iron. drums throbbing in the night the cannibals of darfar oh i guess that's that's what he is he's one of them does this mean that you are in darfar you do not know but you can find out are the darfari wearing bracelets as you are are they also trapped in this land you need to scout one of their camps to find out the darfari are cannibals and will almost always be hostile when encountered they eat human flesh in their worship of the demon god yog good old yog and armorer's bench. All right, so we got a few things on this to-do list, and I'm too damn tired to continue. So I think we're gonna call it a night, there, folks. Oh, hey, how's it going? Uh, yeah. So we don't actually have to go. I don't think we have to go back to. I'm hitting the tilde instead of the. Whoa.